got some more news today, so let's roll that intro! Yo, what is going on everyone? This is Stardust. Welcome back to a new video here on the YouTube channel. Of course, if you're new here, be sure to subscribe, but if you enjoy the video, make sure to give it a like. If you don't enjoy it, buddy, and you can change it to a dislike. We're talking today about new Marvel Spider-Man 2 promotion, all right? Because listen, if people complain about the marketing, complain no more, because we've got even more stuff right here. So there's a good description on the PlayStation website, a bunch of about a bunch of different villains, different locations, and all that stuff. So we've got Venom, this hulking powerful beast has arrived in New York like a twisted natural disaster. The city has seen a lot over the years, but nothing quite like these 19 inches, which is just delicious, you know what I'm saying? Venom is on the prowl, ladies and gentlemen, right? It's an angry little beast. Okay, but next we have Craven, a mysterious force of nature. It's unclear yet who this Craven is. He and his teched out group of mercenaries are clearly here with a purpose. The spider man just need to stop him before they find out what that is. That never happens in superhero movies. We're going to find out what that is. Next, we've got Lizard, Mr. Kurt Connors. Pete met the 10 foot tall out of control lizard in college. Nowadays, Dr. Connors has moved on from his past and is Harry Osborne's personal doctor. We know that is not true. However, the fact that he is Harry's personal Doctor was teased all the way back in Miles Rally, so it's good to see it continue here. Next, we're talking about locations, location descriptions that tease a little bit about where they're going to be sort of in the game and how it's going to work out. So we've got Coney Island. The iconic Brooklyn landmark is the perfect backdrop for an epic showdown where Miles and Peter bring a different kind of firework to the pier. I don't think they're allowed to do that. I think that's illegal, but I could be wrong. Regardless of that, I look forward to seeing them have a scrap on Coney Island. We have the Emily Main Foundation. Of course, this was started by Harry and Peter, Manhattan's newest startup for those who want to heal the world with Harry and Peter at the helm, the odds are definitely in their favour. Or is it? Mwahaha <laughs> and all that stuff. <laughs> um... Brooklyn Visions, Miles aced a seriously tough test to bag a spot at this elite Brooklyn school. Here's hoping he and Genki don't get caught passing Spider-Man related notes in class. Ladies and gentlemen, alright, ladies and gentlemen, okay, imagine if that happens. Imagine if he's just passing a note and suddenly, oh my god, Miles is Spider-Man. Or they might think Genki's Spider-Man, you never know, you know, you know, Spider-Man could have gained a couple of pounds, you know, Genki's a bit of a big boy. Anyway, Aunt May in Peter's house. Peter's childhood home holds a lot of memories, both bitter and sweet. What clues to his past are hidden amongst the trinkets. As long as he doesn't start looking under Aunt May's bed, then I think he'll be alright. Midtown High, the Forest Hills High School where Peter built his first Spider-Man suit. Will he sneak back into the chemistry lab to think up some brand new inventions. Now, I did see someone make a point at uh, Ethan on Twitter, which, you know, I mean, bro's absolutely bagging it recently. Um, and as you see here, it could be this little flash grenade that gets put in front of Venom during the CGI trailer, or maybe not. We no idea, mate. Maybe it's a way to just get rid of the symbiote or whatever. Do you know what I mean? Like, we'll, we'll have to find out. But anyway, that's all for today. I'll see ya. I'll love ya.